years ago, I was in New York and I met a, a book agent and she asked me, you know, have you ever thought about writing a book? And, you know, I had, I had never, but I've always written my music and, um, you know, written ideas for TV shows and just stuff that comes to me, little stories here and there. And um, I thought, you know, it took me about a month, but I came up with an idea and I called her up. I said, so I have an idea, you know, do you want to meet with me? And she's like, sure, you know, and, and I just had, you know, my characters developed and, you know, the idea for the story and kind of that the para paranormal aspect that I wanted in there and the question of if people can actually find their soulmate in life or not and is there life after death. And that was my whole kind of spiel. And she's like, I think it's awesome, you know, do you think you can do this by yourself? And I said no, so I hired a co-writer and we started writing and that was it. She had worked with Elise before and knew her writing and um, I met with her and I said, you know, this is, this is my book and I said, you know, these are my ideas and I really want my voice to be in there but I need guidance and, you know, she, I, was, I was impressed by a book that I read of hers called Populazzi. We really respected each other, you know, she would give me ideas but not, stop, not step on my feet and vice versa, you know, so we were a really, a really good team together. My character in the book, the, the one way that we're very similar is we've been lucky enough to travel all around the world. And so I wanted to put places in there that I loved when I visited and I really loved Rio. I had a great time when I was, I was only here once before but I had an amazing time on the beach and it's such a lively place and I thought it was visually just a really cool way to imagine where it would take place. You know, when things are important, I think you find the time, you know, it's like, it's like a busy mom, you know, like you always find the time to spend with your kid or do your, do the homework or whatever it is, you know, it's yeah, just, it's yeah. so, it's so vital and important to me that whenever I can or I'm in a city and we have a, a, a school there that has the bus and the backpack program, I always visit. Um, it's important to me. There, there's kids that are going hungry in 2011. I mean, it's ridiculous, you know? It's like food is such a vital, important thing for our future and our youth. And, you know, if I can raise awareness and bring my name to anything to get money or get food or get raise awareness, you know, I want to do that.